guys it's your boy john for john's reptile page guys today i did a deep cleaning in the tank cleaned the linen rug cleaned the glass inside the tank inside and outside with hot water wiped everything down cleaned the statues make sure everything is nice and clean nothing is smelling inside the tank why is it important to keep your tank clean because you don't want your bearded dragon to get sick you know because the tank is filthy you know and guys always make sure you keep your tank clean don't leave leftover food for a month you know for two or three days just sitting there because you know how would you like to eat old food you know what i'm saying so make sure they always have fresh food and don't keep old food laying around you know if basically if you're not going to take care of bearded dragons don't buy one because you know bearded dragons can last for a good amount of years so if you're not willing to put in the footwork and all the hard work, you know, for your bearded dragon, then don't get one. Because I heard stories of guys having like house bulbs inside the tank as heat bulbs. That's never going to work because, you know, I got a 100 watt bulb and it's 75 more intense. Right now, my tank is nice and warm. As I wipe in the tank down, you can feel the heat inside the tank. So how how is it that a house bulb is going to work inside the tank? Your bearded dragon is going to get sick. Your bearded dragon is going to die. So basically, if you're not going to have the proper stuff inside your tank and you're not going to keep your tank clean, you know, and if you're not really going to take care of your bearded dragon 100%, then don't get one. Because for me and like other, you know, real reptile lovers, they're going to give their bearded dragons or any reptiles that they have 100% to make sure that they're good and they're going to live long as well as the food you know watch what you give your bearded dragons don't give your bearded dragons things that they can't eat always do your research google if you're not sure and you're gonna get you know good advice from guys that have bearded dragons for a long time you know because i you know people you know post oh my bearded dragon died when they look they don't have the proper lighting they don't give them the proper food you know they don't have the things that they need for every day diet and you know and good proper lighting so they can live so you know make sure you do the right thing for your bearded dragon as i do for mines if you're wondering where my bearded dragons are at my bearded dragons right now <clears throat> they're in the tub taking a nice warm bath you know swimming around doing what they do and they're in good health my bearded dragons right now i gave them collard greens sometimes i give them kale I give them super worms, horn worms, you know, things like that. Always switch it up for them as well. Don't try to give them the same food every day because how would you like to eat the same thing every day? You're not going to like it. You're going to get tired of eating the same thing every day. So, you know, always keep them challenged. Like, you know, you put different things. They're going to go for it, you know. Crickets one day, a couple of days later, horn worms. You know, if you want to put it in between crickets and horn worms, you know, give them something to look forward to when they eat. That's how I do it. I don't like to eat the same thing every day. I don't want my bearded dragons to eat the same thing every single day. Even once in a while, I go get pinky mice. I give them pinky mice. And they enjoy pinky mice. I give them a lot of stuff to eat. But guys, you know, always make sure you guys keep your tank clean. You know, don't keep your tanks dirty, filthy. Because, you know, how would you like to live in filth? I know I wouldn't. So don't do that to your bearded dragons or any reptile or animals. You know, always do the right thing and make sure you, you know, it don't take that long to clean the tank. It just, it took me, I would say like, no lie, like 15 minutes to clean this tank. You know, took everything out, wiped everything down, washed everything nice and clean. So it definitely is not gonna take you hours. So, you know, make sure you guys, you know, do the right thing for your reptiles. I'm getting tired of hearing stories. Oh, I had to be the dragon, but he ain't last long. Oh, he wouldn't eat because you don't have the proper equipment to keep your bearded dragon. And before you go buy a bearded dragon, make sure you have a, a nice setup. You know, you can even start with a 10 gallon because that's how I did. I'm not going to keep on buying tanks every other month. So I just did bought a 10 gallon, you know, like already with stuff inside for a little bit before I got my 40. And it worked out pretty good. And you know, right now I got both bearded dragons together as well, but 
eventually I'm going to separate them because one is a boy, one is a girl. I don't want them to mate. I'm not sure if I'm even going to mate bearded dragons, but I'm looking to get another 40 to just split them up. But, you know, I'm pretty, I like my setup. I was thinking about getting um some, you know, like plants inside the tank or something, a jungle vine or something like that, you know, make it look more, you know, exotic. But for right now, I like the way it looks, you know. But guys, make sure you guys keep your tanks clean, you know, do the right thing for your bearded dragon, you know. That's what matters. If you're not going to get one, if you're going to get one, if you're not going to take care of them, don't get one. So, guys, I'm going to go get my bearded dragons, and I'll be right back. See my girl, Red. She's she's throwing mad colors right now. She's looking great. Let me get a closer view. Look at that. You know, that's your dragon when it's being well taken care of. Look at the colors on her. This is my girl, Red. This is my boy here. This is my leatherback. It's my boy, Capone. This is my girl, Red. They're looking beautiful. You know, I make sure I also give them, you know, a good amount of greens as well as um, insects. But this is how my guys look. And you can tell I take very good care of them. Make sure everything's nice and clean. Right now she's going to get some heat because she was in the tub. So she's gonna warm up a bit. And my boy Capone. So guys, you know, basically make sure you guys take care of your bearded dragons. Make sure you guys do the right thing by them. You know, we bind them because we love them and we're, you know, keeping them to take care of them. You know, as long as we can. Don't buy them if you're not gonna take care of them. I'm out. If you like this video, please like, share, subscribe, and hit that notification bell, guys. If you want to see upcoming more videos, just let me know, guys, what you guys think about this video. I'm out of here.